Hi guys, it's me, Lola. Today I'm going to be showing you how to um, uh, make non playground candies without mods. So, what we're going to do is, okay, play, play, what we're going to do is scroll all the way down to see this map. Click on this. Next, what, what you want to do is you want to take a melon. First, we're going to make, show you how to make strawberry. And then just squish it around in the water for a few minutes. So, as you do, make them fully red like this. And then put them down. Then you're going to want to go in here and then get the healing potion. As you can tell, the healing potion. And if you want to save them, then jump into it. Yep. He is right there, and then if you want to save him, then double tap him, go all the way down, hit save, name him, and then hit save. That's how you make Mr. Strawberry. Just get him out of the way. Now I'm going to be teaching you how to make orange, or something like that, mango. This is how you make mango or orange. So what you want to do is take the orange, the pumpkin in the water, and just swish it around until it looks like a little muffin. And then what you want to do is do the exact same thing. You're going to want to go in here, give them a healing potion. And then boom. Then you're going to save that too. Now we're going to make a rock. So take your coin, do the same thing. Just keep swishing in, in the water like this. And it makes a little bit longer. And then what you want to do is put them right here, this is rock, get them up there, get them a healing potion, like this, give them in a healing potion, put them up, and then you can save him if you want, and then that's him, and then we're going to want to make, we're going to want to make this dude into a, is it inside out apple? A banana, yeah. So this is Mr. Banana. What you want to do is get a potion. Oh, and his stem just came out. Well, make sure that your stem doesn't come out or it will be more like a mango or like a... I don't know. But yeah, you can save him. And then this way you make even more unique characters. So grab the melon. Grab the virus. Just grab the virus like that. Now, yep, I do. Now you're gonna have your virus. Now what you wanna do is swoosh them around. Right after you give him the virus, just swoosh them around until his whole entire body, body turns like this. Now what you wanna do, you're gonna wanna give him a healing potion. So this is like, I, I don't know what, what you want to do. I don't know, like grape or something. I, I, I call him grape, but we're gonna have some other purple ones up here in a second. You can save him. Next we're gonna make pumpkin. But with pu purple pumpkin or whatever. So stab him right there. Boom, boom, boom. Squish him in the water. And then boom, you get like this retro looking thing. And then finally you can do it for, for the other ones. Like this. Now, if you, and then, if, if you guys keep coming upon them, just give him a immortal potion, it really helps. Just swish him around. I gotta say, corn is the hardest to swish around, though. I won't say. Keep doing it until he turns into this. Give him the icon of a healing potion. And then, boom. Finally, you're gonna wanna make this is gonna be a I don't know what to call it an eggplant, I guess. Eggplant, Mr. Eggplant, I guess. Stab him with the virus. Take it out. Swoosh him in the water. Make sure his stem still stays on for the eggplant. Swoosh him in the water. And there's your eggplant. Why do I have the eggplant sand saved? So I'm going to save my eggplant. Like this. Eggplant. 
And then we're gonna show you how to make the skeletons. You can either do this with a spring flowing. I'm not gonna do it with a spring flowing. You can bond up with the spring flowing. But an easier way to do this is with an acronym. Now this is way easier. It bonds them. It makes them also a skeleton. So, boom. And then there you go. And then they do skeleton. And if you want to make them a fire skeleton, they just let them sit there for a little bit. Boom, they do skeleton. Clear everything.